write a program that will identify the number whether that's a prime number or a composite number so let's see before that i want to import a modulus which is math mo module let's have a variable n is equal to an integer we take from the user I'll be take an integer from the user and let's have an f statement here that f n is lesser than 2 obviously the f statement is very important in any programming languages so a number let's have this statement must be more than more than or larger than larger than one and let's wait to this again elif n is equal to two so let's run this it is prime number so if this condition is true n is equal to 2 we just run this statement quit let's quit this and let's initialize i into 2 as equal to 2 we just initialize this or assign let's have a limit limit which will be integer and math function is qrt so see when uh, we import the math function here import math so math uh, contains many functions like square root so like sine cos cos tangent like this so let's run this have this program so that we just assign limit the limit variable so it can be called a variable let's have a while loop here while while i is lesser or equal to limit so if this condition is true and just run this so moduli n moduli i is equal to zero see in while statement in the body of while statement we have another if statement so this if statement explains that when n divided by i and the remainder is equal to zero if this condition is true if the remainder so this is the remainder sign or modulus so if this condition is true just run this so the number which will be entered it is composite number obviously let's again quit this this is a function we use here so let's increment the i i is equal to i plus one so we can increment like this as well i plus equal to one so both of them are correct or same we just use the first one because Will be easier to you as well to understand this let's have a print statement out of the loop so this print statement will be out of the loop it is prime number so 
let's run this program and see what is the asks a number I'll have number 17 let's see 17 is a prime number let's run once again this program you may think that here's nothing is shown to us because here we had nothing so let's have enter a number let's have this message I'll be run stop and run Let's have 25. It is a composite number, obviously. Let's run once again this program and see. Let's run 20. When we give 20, it is a composite number.